Jacqueline, Mrs. Nyergot, the principal of this institution, that is St. Paul's Teacher Training College. I'm a professional teacher. I trained uh, from 1998 to 2001 and I uh, started teaching. Although I have also trained as a business person, I did become as another course. I specialized in finance option. In my master's, I also did MBA, finance option. I'm almost, almost done with my PhD. And all this I've done while in this institution. This college is an old college. It was started in 1986. So it is 32 years old, it's quite old. And it has trained a number of teachers, over 10,000 teachers, and they are doing very well out there. It, this college was started by the late Bishop Tiberius Mugendi, who went to rest, he is now passed. But uh, he really loved this college, and he started this college. Not that there were no colleges in the country, but uh, he taught by starting this college, we could have gotten uh, all round teachers, both spiritually and uh, good performing teachers out there. And yes, he actually, it has been succeeded. It is doing well when it comes to all that I've said. The motto of this college is to excel in all good things. Our bishop is the patron of this college. Actually, this college is a Catholic sponsored college. It is Mission College, and uh, the chairman is Father Mandere. And of course, I'm the principal, as I said earlier. It's not a very, it's not a very, very big college. It has only two departments. That is, uh, we offer ECD program, and we also offer P1 program. In ECD program, we have a diploma, and we also have certificate. Of course, we have those who come to bridge before they do certificate, and we call them the provisions. We also have P1. Actually, the main reason why the college was started is to train P1 teachers. But because of the emerging issues, ECD also came along. It's used during weaving. Material that is used during weaving. One? Saiso. Saiso. Yes. For someone to qualify, to do a P1 course, you must have a qualification of assistant or above. For ECD, it must be a D plus and above, that is certificate. But those who bridge, that is D plane uh, downwards, our population ranges from 250 to 300. Although we are planning to expand it, to diverse to diversify so that we can be able to start other co other courses that is from january we have done a few buildings and we hope by december we will have done marketing and we will have also completed the construction that is underway it's unfortunate that our students are not benefiting from uh, help but soon the ministry pr uh, promised that they are going to start benefiting from the same. We have uh, categories of students. There are those who are able and we also have those who are quite needy. So what the college has done, they have introduced a work program such that for those needy students, they can be able to be given some work over the holiday during the weekend so that they can be able to, to get even pocket money. So we try to assist those who don't uh, manage in one way or another. When possible, we can also get them sponsors. Get our students from different areas 
or catchment areas that is it uh, all over the country we also do very well in co-curricular activities in our college we have drama we have music and we always participate up to national levels when it comes to sports we are also doing very very well more especially athletics The college has a very big farm and very fertile. Uh, we are able to sustain ourselves by growing vegetables, bananas, sweet potatoes. Even as we consume as a college, we also sell to our neighboring institutions, which we tender and we are paid at, uh, at a monthly level. We have a big hen uh, project we have the broilers, we have layers, uh, layers, and we also have the improved Kenyezi. This one is supposed to serve purposes of the college, like we give our students, tutors, consumer, but we can also sell when it is in excess. Lastly, the college has planted a number of uh, trees. Right now we have three forests. There is one that contains 10,000 trees and there is another one that has uh, 4,000 and there is a small one that we have just started planting which has 1,000 though we want to increase it also to 5,000. Our strategy is that by the end of next year we will have managed 20,000 trees so that in the future we are able to to get our own firewood and if we are doing even construction you can be able to do that comfortably without much stress. My name is Happiness Nendri from St. Paul's TTC. I thank God for giving us this knowledge of starting this project. I also thank the administration for giving us resources for planting these trees. If I can talk briefly about the inter-county games that is currently going on, we are very, very happy as an institution and as a county because for sure this came and it is kind of going to improve our economy because each and every person in the county is likely to benefit. Of course, there are those who will benefit in a big way and there are those who will benefit in a small way, but what we are saying, it is going to improve uh, the economy of our, our our county. Our expectation was very, very high because when we were told this news that uh, we are going to have inter-county games, uh, we were very, very happy because each and every person started strategizing on how they are going to tap these resources. But it's unfortunate that uh, the numbers we expected didn't turn and so even the sales didn't do very, very well as much as you can not complain and say we benefited even if a little. As a college, I can say that I'm proud and I'm, I'm also humbled that I was able to host uh, mus the music people who have come and uh, we have appreciated that in our country we have uh, diverse cultures and each culture has something to teach other people. Each culture was trying to present according to their culture. As much as judging was done, in my own observation, if I was given that chance to judge, I could have said that all I've done is very well because each culture is trying and uh, is really trying to compete. And by the end of the day, we were able to see 
very very good items <laughs> It is really encouraging and of course this one is also going to promote peace in our country so i really feel that this could be continued and if possible it can even be done it goes all over the country it goes round 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 so that at the end of the day each count benefits from the same <laughs>